reasons. This is a warning to those who play with the Ouija board. Don't ever play with Ouija board. Don't. October is the strongest month for the spirit realm to be weaker than wet paper. Wet toilet paper. Be more excited. Be more precise. Guys, if you're out there watching this chat, watching this video, and I suggest you not play with Ouija board. Ouija boards are dangerous. Believe me. Here's a story. When I was young, I got it for my Christmas when I was 10 years old. Me and my friend Anna played with it. But the room was starting to make noises, and we were starting to get scared, and we got out of there. As soon as she was coming home, I forgot to end the game, and I should have done it in the first place, but I didn't end the game. After that, I was followed constantly by something dark, something medicine to my adult life. It drove me nuts, maybe scared of everything. And came to me at the worst times growing up as an adult. But then last, la but then last year of 2017, a friend of mine removed him from my life, and I was free. I was free from this demon and from this shadow person. He's known as the Hat Man. So if you watch my videos and you're following, still following my channel over all these years, don't play with a Ouija board. And don't you dare let kids play with it either. If they play it, they open a door to devils. Or demon. <laughs> Believe me. It's not always safe to play a game. Just play Candyland or Uno or even like Clue or Life maybe. But Ouija board. Never. Ever. Ouija board. It's the worst game of them all. <sighs> Have a good day, everybody. And watch out for the Ouija boards. They may look fun, but they're dangerous. As much as a killer loose on Halloween night can lose kids. Pleasant nightmares.